the next way to optimize a website is SEO backlink. Now backlink means when one site has links present in various other sites. Okay, so if one site uh, like I have created a site and link of my site is present in many other sites. So they are called as backlinks. Backlinks are links on one site that when click take the user to another site. Backlinks are especially valuable for SEO because they contribute to the overall strength and value of the content. Now what happens is more the number of backlinks more will be the rank when search engines are going to check that this website has these many backlinks and the people are going to visit the website more then the ranking of the website will increase and google will display the your website in the first few search results they also represent vote of confidence from one site to another now if the link is present in one of the site like I have a website and my website link is present in say Wikipedia. Now this says that Wikipedia is a trusted site. In this way Google will also feel that my website is also trusted. So in a way Wikipedia is voting in for confidence yes this site is also trusted the content over here is good and we will get more and more audiences. Backlinks are signal to search engines that they are interested to know about the content. Now if a backlink is present in another site then the search engine will see that the people are interested in this content also from the new site also and that is why it is going to rank it higher. So here in the diagram you can see this is the web page, our web page which we have created and here these are the links which are present on various different sites. More the number of backlinks, more will be the ranking. <coughs> Next, SEO, social bookmarking. Now bookmarking we all know, we all have bookmarked our pages. If I want that this particular website, I want to visit again and again. In that way, I bookmark it on my particular machine, on my local machine, and I visit it again and again. This bookmarking, when it is done on any of the social websites, okay, social networking websites, then it is called as social bookmarking. It is powerful tool for promoting the website. So, if the link is present on any of the social websites, people are going to check that and they will visit the website. So it is promoting our website. It is useful for off-page SEO optimization. So here again the link is present in another page. There is nothing related with the content. So this is also a off-page SEO optimization. This will also increase the number of backlinks. So there are different websites. Red Hat, Dig, Tumblr. So all these are different websites. Social networking websites where a person can bookmark their own website. Bookmarks are website links stored for future references. Now if once the website is bookmarked in that social uh, networking site, we can refer to that for our future also. This method helps to save, organize and share bookmarks with others. Now if a bookmark is saved, if a link is saved from there, you can share it to other people also. External links are important SEO factors to rank a website higher in the search engine. So whenever we have more and more references coming from the different website, different trusted websites, then the rank of our website goes higher. Okay, so it is important that external links should be present for the website. With social bookmarking, high quality backlinks can be created. So it is nothing but a way of creating a backlink also, but the backlinks which are created must be quality backlinks. Next, social media optimization. Social media optimization again 
then on social media you are promoting your page if you are creating if you have a company you have a website you have created a facebook page you have created a page on twitter so all this is social media optimization where you are optimizing your page and creating it on different social media so that people can come and view your page it deals with enhancing the website ranking using interactive communities like facebook twitter blogs forums so if i have a page on facebook people are going to like that page from that page they can come and visit my website and in in the long run it will increase the ranking of the website so these are the different various websites social for social media optimization google plus twitter facebook youtube skype all this can be used when these communities have links to created websites it builds familiar familiarity and trust about the website now i visit facebook every time i visit instagram every time if on instagram or on in facebook i see a particular page facebook is trusted i know that facebook is giving me some good links some good pages so if facebook is trusted in that way the pages which are listed there will also be trusted okay so in this way it is a trust building factor and the new websites will also get more and more traffic the last one is other factors speed of the website now if we have created a website and it takes very long to load then people will not come and visit the website so it is very important that you see that the website should load properly design content and many visual factors can slow down the website and obstruct usability so you have to manage the content the visuals the images which are being used they should be compressed the design which is used should be such that it does not take very long to load okay if it is taking long then people might visit it they will start loading loading and nobody has that much patience they will close and they will go for another one next one mobile friendly now these days most of the work is done using a mobile using a smartphone so that is why all the websites which are created must be mobile friendly because if it is not present on my mobile now even these days if i want to do any kind of shopping rather than opening my desktop rather than opening my laptop i do it on my phone okay so that is why these websites must be mobile friendly so that people can use it properly okay so this is one of the fact the ranking factor for google thus websites must be mobile mobile friendly for maximum exposure and to improve website ranking if the mobile uh, website is not mobile friendly if it is not showing me properly uh, on my smartphone then i will not prefer to use it i will use another website because it gives me a better look and feel the last point creating robots dot text so this is one text file where we are writing some pages we are writing some urls and we are telling the search engine which pages pages should be excluded from indexing okay so this is nothing but a text file so that we can exclude some pages from the indexing so these are the different ways in which we can optimize our website okay thank you